This home offers over 500 square feet of living space, two bedrooms, and the ultimate chef's kitchen. Welcome to the Orca Edition. When you enter into the Orca Edition, you step directly into the kitchen and the living space of the home. And this is where you get an idea of just how large this floor plan really is. The 12 feet in width gives you tons of room in this space to walk around. You can set a table and chairs down in this space and still have enough room around the kitchen space and by the door here to move around comfortably. The kitchen is easily one of the most impressive rooms in this house. You can see here you have tons of counter space and it's in the form of an L shape here. You've got stainless steel appliances ranging from a large fridge and freezer off to the front of me here. You've got a microwave with a built-in exhaust fan. You've got a propane cooktop and oven. And then finally, down to my right over here, you've got a 24-inch dishwasher as well. In addition to these items, you also get a ton of overhead cabinets. And finally, off to the right-hand side of the kitchen here, you get a floor-to-ceiling pantry with adjustable shelving. The kitchen also comes with multiple plug-in spots along the wall above the counter space to plug in appliances. And you get a nice big ceramic sink here with a window above it. Once you've moved past the kitchen space, you'll enter the living room here. And because this home is 44 feet in length, you have plenty of room to separate the kitchen and living areas. In this space, you'll find enough room to put a couch along the far wall here. You've got more than enough space in between to put a coffee table or ottoman. And then against the wall here, you've got a little mantle, electric fireplace, and then all the plugins you're going to need to mount a TV on the wall as well. What really helps to open up this space is all of the windows you get on each of the walls here. And the shed style roof really helps to lift that ceiling and make this space feel bright and open. Just above my head here, you can see this home is outfitted with a mini split heating and cooling system. This is one of two units. The other one is gonna be at the other end of the home in the master bedroom. In addition to those systems, you'll find in-floor heat registers for the propane furnace. And the home also has in-wall heat registers. And just as we enter the first of the two rooms here, up on the wall to the left of the door, you'll find the Lunos HRV air filtration system, which helps mitigate any humidity that builds up in the home and keeps the fresh air moving throughout these rooms. In the first of the two bedrooms here, you'll find enough room to put a queen size bed. You've got exposed shelving on either side of the bed here mounted to the wall. You also get three separate windows in this space to bring in lots of that natural light. Up on the wall in the corner here, you'll find one of the returns for the HRV system I spoke about earlier. And then just across from me on this wall, you'll have a wardrobe to hang all of your clothing. And to the right of that wardrobe is an area where you can put maybe a chair or a desk in that space. As we move past the kitchen and the living room area here, we'll enter into a little hallway. And in this hallway, you'll find the stacking laundry unit. Next to it, you've got a countertop with plugs where you can fold your laundry. Above this countertop, you also have overhead cabinetry as well as lower cabinets. In these lower cabinets, you've got storage off to the right-hand side and then the home's hot water down to the left. And then just across from this area, you also have cabinets on this wall over here as well. Just across from the laundry setup, we enter the bathroom space. And in here, as soon as you enter to your left, you'll find the vanity with storage beneath it. Off to my right-hand side here, you've got three exposed shelves, and then beneath it, you have a residential-style toilet. And then finally, on the opposite wall here, you have a nice big walk-in shower. Finally, at the very back of the home, you'll find the master bedroom. In here is your second point of entry. You've got multiple windows in this space, once again, to bring in that natural light. And as I mentioned previously, you'll find the second mini split heating and cooling system up on the wall here. You've got enough floor space in here to fit either a queen or a king size bed. And once again, you have those two exposed shelves on either side of the bed. On the right hand side of the room against the wall here, we've got two large wardrobes where you can store all of your clothing. And then finally, the wall opposite of the bed space, you've got a spot to mount your TV. This home is currently available for immediate sale and is listed at 215,500 Canadian dollars or approximately 160,000 US dollars using today's exchange rate. If you or someone you know is looking for more information on this home, I'll be sure to add the floor plan layout on screen for you here. Otherwise, all the additional information you're going to need is found in the description of this video. Thanks so much for watching today and we'll see you guys in the next video. To view our available inventory and to learn more about how we can build your dream tiny home, visit us online and book a consultation call today.